We're going to proceed to the next uh, lesson. So if you have textbook, please turn to page 202. Okay, so we're going to discuss experiment 6.9. So this experiment is conducted to identify the anion presence in aqueous salt solution. So what is an ion? So an ion is a negative ion. So in this experiment, we'll be tested for a type of an ion, which is your carbonate salt, your chloride salt, your sulfate, and nitrate. So since that the chemicals in the laboratory is quite limited, so I'm only going to uh, demonstrate the experiment uh, number three, which is the test of chloride ions. Okay, so take a look of the procedure. So, uh, number one, so add excess of two mole of nitric acid into test tube containing your sodium chloride. So I have two cm cube of my sodium chloride. So in my sodium chloride, there will be a presence of chloride of ions. Okay, so from the procedure, we need to add excess of two mole of nitric acid. So uh, how much is excess? So I'm going to add about uh, two to five drop of nitric acid. As you can see here, it is colorless. And when acid is added, so the color remains colorless. Okay, next. And then we're going to add your 1, 2 cm cube of 0 0.1 silver nitrate solution. So I have my silver nitrate solution over here. So I'm going to keep it aside first. So this is my sodium chloride solution. And I'm going to measure approximately 2 cm cube of argentum chloride eh, sorry argentum nitrate so i will going to add my argentum nitrate inside my uh, solution just now okay. can you see what happened so the solution is no longer colorless so there is a presence of white solid. So what happened? So as we can see here, as we added your argentum nitrate, so argentum ion inside the argentum nitrate will react with the chloride ion. So what happened? It will produce another type of salt which is insoluble salt which is argentum chloride. So the color of argentum chloride is a white solid as you can see uh, here. Okay. 